the Bible says, Now therefore give me this mountain, or of the Lord spake in that day. For thou heardest in that day how the Anakims were there, and that the cities were great and fenced. If so be the Lord will be with me, then I shall be able to drive them out, as the Lord said. When all of Israel, or most of the Israelites, doubted God's promises, there was one that believed. His name was Caleb. And when it came time to receive the inheritance that God had sworn to his tribe, Caleb came to Joshua and said, Give me this mountain. His faith made him long for new heights. His desire to wholly follow the Lord, as Caleb had always done, kept him strong in his old age and kept his desire fervent to get all God had for him, no matter what enemies seemed to stop it. No matter what giants seemed to be in his way, he knew that if God said it, God could give it to him and accomplish this inheritance. Dear child of God, are you content to stay below? Or do you long for the mountain God has waiting for you? Do you have enough faith like Caleb to believe what God said and seize the inheritance the Lord has waiting for you? To get to that place of blessing, to get to that place of victory, to get to those new heights, that mountain the Lord may have for you today by wholly following the Lord. Is that your desire, Christian? Could you say to your Jesus, your Joshua, give me this mountain? What is the mountain the Lord has waiting for you? What is the new heights of faith and victory the Lord has reserved for you? Are you too busy looking at the obstacles? Too busy being intimidated by the giants? Or have you gotten to the place God said it. That settles it. And will you trust that as the Lord said he would give you this mountain, will you seize your inheritance today and be all that God has for you?